Hey everyone, I'm Zoc Lee and welcome to another Space Engineers update video. This week's minor update release contains more crash fixes and general improvements as the team continues working towards the next major release. I'm also happy to announce that we are releasing an updated 3D model OBJ exporter today that will work with the latest version of the game. This will allow you to create 3D prints of your creations and upload them to sites like Sketchfab, opening up many new ways to share what you build in Space Engineers. You can even add a Sketchfab model to the Steam Workshop page of your creation, providing an interactive preview to other players before they download and use it in-game. For today's work in progress section, I would like to talk to you about the status of improved rotors and pistons in multiplayer. The V-Rage engine team have been working tirelessly on this and have made significant advancements. Here is Bruce Lido Lido Lee's ARC's heavy battle tank, which features working tracks. It also happens to be a vehicle the programmers are using for testing both sync and performance. As you can see, it's an impressive and incredibly fascinating build which can move at surprisingly high speeds. While it works okay in single player, there are numerous desync issues with it in the current multiplayer implementation. However, the team have now actually managed to get this working in multiplayer on one of our internal prototype builds with minimal desync. You can look forward to hearing more about this and similar improvements in the coming weeks. In other news, next Monday we will be streaming at 7pm CEST on the Keen Community Network over on Twitch. The first segment will be with Deep Flame looking at Medieval Engineers and its upcoming major release, which includes a new shovel tool and a UI redesign. Later in the stream, there will be a Q&A session with Marek and other members of the team here at Keen Software House. But that's all for now. If you're interested in the full list of bug fixes, tweaks, and improvements in this update, please see the change log on our forums. Thanks for watching, I'll see you all next week, and here's something to end on. I have a new theory on inertia, but it doesn't seem to be gaining momentum.